Hello everybody and welcome or welcome back to another edition of Let's Play where we play games and things usually, well, I usually play them for like 15 minutes, but as you can see, there's somebody else in the shot. It's John. Hey. For those of you who don't know, who haven't seen him before, John is my husband. We are going to play Untitled Goose Game by House House. House House is, I believe, a smaller studio based out of Australia. Yes. They're pretty fun. They were in the process of developing another game, I think, that was announced at one of the Nintendo previews. Yeah, I don't remember what what it was that they were making, but they're doing something. We'll put the information down below, but the in a nutshell description of Untitled Goose Game is you are a goose and you are causing chaos. Yes. You may do it as a solo goose or you can do it as two geese. A, a, a tandem goose duo of destruction. Yeah, exactly. We are the brothers of destruction. We're gonna go ahead, I'm gonna hit begin, and of course, single player, two player, we're gonna go with two player because we want twice the destruction, okay? Yes, destruction. All right, press a button when you're ready. So you're player one, I'm player two? Yes. We can override that if you want. Oh, we're gonna go to save three. What I love about the save screens, or like the save options, is their notebooks. <laughs> <laughs> this game never gets it. <laughs> okay, so I am the I'm the salmon colored goose. You're you're the horn billed goose, and, and and I am John the standard murder goose. I was gonna say you're the John's goose is the goose. John's goose. John's goose is the goose that you'd usually see um, like if you're swan. playing uh, solo. It's all pretty straightforward. I actually played this earlier today by myself, so this is kind of a crash or recap for me, but that's okay. It's already chaos, and it's only been like a minute. <laughs> John's got the shoe. Where's the tennis ball? Oh, it's up there. Oh, did you drop your boot? Haha, <laughs> now I have the ball. Damn you. Here, have the ball. No, it's okay. We gotta go. We gotta go make the farmer mad. Oh, bottom one. There we go. <laughs> so if you haven't played Untitled ah. Goose Game before, generally the idea is that you create chaos. But each sort of section is mandatory chaos that you must commit. So the first one that we're coming up on is dealing with a farmer. It's just some dude who tends to a garden but uh, there are other things that we have to do that are kind of related to the farmer. So yes. you can see John is holding onto a picnic basket there because- I'm getting ready. If you come down here, you'll see for some odd reason, and we don't know whose blanket it is, we never find out, there's a picnic blanket out. So if you hit with the PlayStation controller, the center- Hamburger. You get a list of things that you need to do and there's a to-do list for every section so for this one um for sure what we're going to do is get into the garden get the groundskeeper wet steal the groundskeeper's keys make the groundskeeper wear his sun hat rake in the lake have a picnic and under have a picnic you need to bring a sandwich an apple a pumpkin uh, pumpkin carrot jam thermos radio and as you can see the basket's already crossed off because john's goose just put the basket on the blanket. Yep. So what do we want to do first? Uh, well, I mean. The apple and the whatever, sandwich. Whatever we can to. Uh, to make this list the, easier. In the next 15-ish uh, minutes. Yeah. So what I found really funny about this earlier was that you can't just bring one half of the sandwich. You have to bring both halves. Yeah, you have to bring a whole sandwich. <laughs> you can I mean, only, well, only one whole sandwich, not I half. Mean, who's only going to eat half a sandwich? When I was playing this earlier, and it had apple. I totally forgot about because I knocked it over when I was doing all the. Did you knock it into the lake? I knocked it into the lake. Into the lake. <laughs> and I was like, I'll just go get the other apple from the farmer. I think to open the door, we gotta get that radio. But yeah, we're gonna get him to. John's gonna get him to open the door. There is a space on the side that you can get through. Oh my god! You. Oh, look at that. Ah, fuck you. 
We've already done three things, and it's not even so. We've gotten well, the groundskeeper. If, if, he, if he gets the keys, we we don't get to no, do it. No, no. But oh, you should go turn the radio back on. This is promising. Where's the radio? Did he take it oh, back did in? He grab the radio? Oh, no, it's, oh over it's over there. It's over there. You still have his keys, so you're mm -hmm. fine. Just don't. Yeah, we keep it over here. Oh, I have to go around. There is so much happening right now, like it's actually overstimulating. Okay, now he's locked out. Okay, great. Except we gotta get some of the stuff. We don't need a pumpkin, do we? Yeah, we do. All right, he's been locked out. Look, I can swim with my pumpkin. Yeah. Uh, I believe we also need a carrot. I love that he's still locked out. Oh, uh, don't we need- we gotta do rake in the lake, which we need the gate open for. Uh, do we? Yeah. I thought we could get it out through the hole. Can we? Well, I mean, we're gonna try. I usually- I've usually gotten it out through the gate, so... I like how this goose is so strong you can pull a whole bag of fucking concrete. You know, when I was initially shooting footage for this as a solo, play i was saying to my i was saying to the camera earlier i was like could you imagine how strong the neck muscles of these geese must be how not tasty they probably are what are you talking about you just gotta braise it you'd be delicious oh yeah i suppose you also have to make him wear the sun hat oh we'll let him back in in a minute okay but i can't remember how to do that we'll figure it out <laughs> Are you going to actually fit that rake in there? I don't know. I'm going to find oh, out. Oh, maybe not. Oh, I can't go anywhere now. Oh, shit! No! No! I like how he's trying to shoo me away. Like, oh. you think that's going to stop me? You think that's going to stop me from causing chaos in your life? Oh, he saw the rake. Could you just imagine, like, in your real life, you're doing, you're just minding your own business and these two geese just show up out of nowhere? Now he's thinking about the, uh... Hey! Leave me alone! I'm an innocent goose. Me now, is he? Oh! <gasps> you did it! Of course I did it. Breaking through, the lake! Through perseverance and rage, we have done it. Breaking the lake! Okay, let's see what's... Oh, you got the jam! Nice. Okay. Uh, scoot over this way so we don't draw his attention. You gotta go through this grassy area. Okay, we got the jam. I'll get a carrot. Do you wanna go get the thermos while I get the carrot? Sure. Okay. Yes. All right. This is really hard work. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Motherfucker! <gasps> No! Are you kidding me? Bros is gonna block that area now? Uh, get closer to the hole. Here. Hey, buddy! How's it going? Now he's just telling you to shoo. Oh, for frick's sakes. I think he's gonna turn around and see me, though. Shit. I've never seen it- No! Leave me alone! <laughs> you gotta make a beeline for the lake. Okay. Grab it. Quick, into the water! How far into the water will he go? I guess he thinks it's a lost cause. Uh, down? Just to get out of his line Oh, like side. here? Yeah. Okay. Okay. I think now we're safe. Okay, excellent. It's really hard being a goose, guys. So we still need to make him wear his sun hat. That's the only thing we have left and grab the radio. Let's see how this goes. Hello. Don't tell me to shoo. You shoo. Flower. <laughs> okay. So idea. Okay. Drop the flower up over there. Uh, near the, uh, yeah, the other the, gate? Like over here. Yeah, that's good. Here? Yeah. Okay. And then what we need to do is I need you to open the gate. And then I'm going to make off with the radio. Okay. Because then once he gets back in. Dude is mad. He's just throwing yeah. stuff. 
Because once he gets back in, you need to grab, you need to close the door, and then on the way out, grab the keys, which are over by the hole over here. This is so much harder than it needs to be. Okay. It's not, because he'll just chase us because he can hear the radio. Okay, so you want me to open this gate? Yep. We need the, the keys to open <laughs> the gate. Okay, well. If you can get the radio in, in with the radio into the water, I have the keys. We're just gonna go into the water, yeah. I guess. Yeah. We're just cruising down the water. So the last thing we need to make him do is wear his hat. Okay. Have you just thing. hiss at me? No. Oh. Crossed it off. <gasps> A new to-do list item. Let's see. Oh, make the groundskeeper hammer his thumb. Should I just hold on to the keys then? Yeah. Because we need to let himself in. Yeah. Hello? Hi? Hey, they're right here, dummy. <laughs> Where is he? Is I it? think he went up and around. There he oh, is. there he is. Okay, here we go. I think he's opening the gate. Oh, look at that. Gate open. Oh, bro's got a shovel. Don't you dare. Should I close the gate? Sure. Uh, oops. Well, we had to use the pumpkin for a very important purpose, sir. Uh, we have to grab his hat while he's leaning down. I have an idea. We will bait him. <laughs> I am sneaky. Yes! No! <laughs> we need to escape. Because he can't get his hat back. Otherwise he just puts his normal hat on. Note this way. Oh. Alright. Is he gonna put the sun hat on now? It's the only other hat he's got, so hopefully yes. Yes! Nice. And now we gotta make him a hammer's thumb, right? Oh, we can do that easy. He has a sign prepared just for this occasion. That's fine, we don't need those anyway. And we did it. Let me go! I'm stuck! No! Goodbye. We're free! We're free to roam. Oh my gosh. That was fun. That was actually really fun. I think the one, there are obviously quite a few limitations to this game. There were always limitations to begin with, but I think yeah. the real funny one that you gotta watch out for is just the camera. Yeah. The amount of camera that you have to work yeah. with as a, as coupled geese, especially when one person just likes to play and the other one needs more help. I mean, it's a it's a fun game. It's enjoyable to just cause chaos, right? Like Untitled Goose Game in general is just the perfect sandbox to be a butthead goose. Yeah, be a butthead. <laughs> That's pretty accurate. All right, well, thanks for watching. And I guess at least I... We'll see you in the next one, or maybe John will see you in the next one. We don't know yet. We'll see. We'll, we'll find you. Yeah. All right. Okay, bye. Bye. <laughs>